Okay, so this video is for anybody who wants to work with images uh, and codify them in Vivo and or text. And often people want to synchronize both. So I might have an image and I might have some commentary around the image or a transcript where somebody is talking about the content of the image and I want to link up these two items and I also want to code them. So to do that, um, you can see this is the standard tutorial that comes preloaded with Vivo environmental changes down east it's called the sample project and in this folder here called area and township we have an image called competing water uses and there's some commentary over here on the right under content about the various uh, elements that are competing so these are the waterfront homes if i click on that part it highlights that part of the image this is the commercial fishing boats and these are the recreational boats so i can immediately associate whatever the text is with all are part of the image. Now, if I wanted to add another comment here, um, I'm just going to edit this image so it opens read only so we don't accidentally edit it. And I'm going to select a passage here. I want to, I want to talk about the water quality here. So I can right click on this space that I've just highlighted the text or the area of the image that I want to work with. And I can do insert row. And it not only inserts the row, it inserts the grid reference to the row. And, um, and so I can type my comment here about water quality. And that's now linked. So now when I click here, I see the recreational fishing boats. When I click here, I see the water quality. I may also want to code this. I'm just going to unedit it there for a minute because I have it done now. So I just make sure I don't do anything I don't want to do with the image. I'm going to widen this here just so I can see my codes. And I'm going to go down here to my coding area. And let's imagine now I wanted to code uh, this part, this this comment. So you can see when I grab it to code it that it's, it's already recognizing which part of the image. I'm just going to drag this out to a new code. Uh, water front coding and I create my code and I it's it's now coded there I've dragged the text you can see there's one reference in there so when I open it up what you see inside the code is I have my image coded there's a picture tab on the side it just tells me that there's a comment coded here from this image but if I, if I click on the side here where it says picture, there's the full context, there's the coded context. So if I click there, I see the comment and I see the part of the image that's associated with that. I can also code the image in full or part without the text. It's just an option that it does both. But if I've made this synchronized comment, then it does automatically take that part of the image with it. So I hope that's helpful for anybody that wants to work in that way.